Most people would walk right by this plant and not know what it is. Yet it was one of the most important wild edible plants to indigenous cultures all throughout North America. You might recognize it by its green leaf, which you'll see in the summer. But those leaves are long gone, and it has now gone to seed in the fall and winter. And those seeds are what I'm after today. This plant is called Lamb's Quarter and it is one of the most nutritious wild plants on planet Earth. Just one lamb's quarter plant can produce up to 100,000 seeds. Caches of lamb's quarter seeds that are thousands of years old have been found in caves throughout North America. Lamb's quarter is related to quinoa, and the seeds can be prepared and eaten in a similar way. Tiny black seeds are covered in a papery sheath, which I need to winnow away, but it's a process that I rather enjoy.
and now I'm left with thousands of tiny seeds that I could eat raw, use as grain, or grind into flour. People ask me all the time why I take the effort to go out into the wild and forage for food like this. And the answer is simple. It connects me to my past, it connects me to my food, it connects me to the woods, it connects me to my soul, and it connects me to the one who made that. Toasting these seeds seems to bring out the flavor, and you can see and hear them popping like little tiny pieces of popcorn. While my seeds are toasting, I'll cut up my figs for my lamb's quarter seed and fig stew that I'll be having for lunch today. Well, I have to tell you that all this effort has really worked up an appetite for me. It smells awesome. It smells really toasty. 
and nutty and sweet like that fig. I cannot wait to try this. Let's get a little bit of both here, the fig and the lamb's quarter seeds and give it a shot. Oh my gosh. It's really crunchy. The texture of those seeds is really cool. The first flavor I get is kind of like popcorn. It was like popcorn flavored. Those seeds, how I toasted them in that pan. They're nutty, they're popcorn flavored. And then the sweetness of that fig makes for such an awesome tasting bowl of awesomeness and survival. It tastes so hearty. It tastes so healthy. It tastes like survival. Like you could go out into the woods and literally harvest a hearty meal like this is incredible. Just taste some of these seeds by themselves. Man, those are so good. There's no wonder why this plant was such a favorite of indigenous cultures. Not only tastes good, especially toasted like that, but it's just so hearty and so healthy and you can taste that when you eat it. I wish you were here right now. Because <laughs> if you were, I would pour you a bowl of this lamb's quarter seed and fig stew. And we would enjoy this beautiful day together. Mm-mm-mm. <sighs>